lazy toy reviews is just too sweet. It's survey time. Blazing Toy Reviews, this is your host Lito, and today we got Unbox Fridays. Blazing! Alright guys, I stopped at my local Target today, and I ran into this fellow over here. So I was like, you know what? Why not? Let's pick it up. We got the cloth goods, and uh, you know, even though the NWO Elite was short-lived, Scott Hall had his moments, you know? So, let's open it up. And let's get this going. Alright. And we got that here. Alright. Uh, careful not to mess the box up. Because even though I do open my fingers, I like to keep the box um, as clean as possible, you know? Alrighty, we got over here Scott Hall out of the box um, with his NWO Elite attire, um, which uh, NWO Elite was introduced back in um, the early 1999 era. Um, so that's when the original Wolfpack basically split because Sting wasn't a part of it no more. So, um, you know, and of course Scott Hall was introduced in it so yeah that was a big change you know so yeah he, he comes over here with some elbow pads and just like you if you go ahead and you see it on youtube he has just a black one over here and he has like the bloody looking one over here he got the bloody um knee pads nice some nice bright red boots which look pretty nice um haul over here and wolf pack in the back um written pretty cool the long hair we got the bandana over here um this part is not attached i don't know if that's actually how it was supposed to go. oh it's removable cool even better um so yeah we got the bandana over here it is removable slides right off no residual glue nothing so it's 100 percent removable for sure so that's basically an accessory there then it comes with um two other pairs of hands giving it a thumbs up Another wolf pack hand over here. Another gripping hand over here. Oh, also came with this mic over here. I just wanted to show you guys real quick. That's cool. Got like a Starcade type of emblem there, more or less. So that's pretty cool. You can kind of see the uh, the background WWE a little bit, but it looks like a Starcade type of emblem. So that's Cool. Hey yo. Nah, no, just playing. Well, yeah. Now we got his NWO shirt over here. Uh, NWO Elite Wolfpack shirt, cloth, velcroed. Uh, so let's put that on. See how that looks. Ready. Yep. And there's there's the cloth on, so that's how it looks. Pretty cool. Of course, if you need, you had a custom, or you need another, um, or you needed an extra shirt for the actual Wolfpack one, you can always uh, always use it on somebody else. You know, if you're not gonna use it on him, you know. So, but yeah, we got the little Wolfpack. Just too sweet. 
You're either with us or against us. Hey, yo. <laughs> but yeah, man. Uh, let's change his hands. Let's see how it looks. Maybe he's throwing out both wolf pack signs. So. figure man I was lucky because when I found it it was hidden behind some other figures like the, he put it all the way somebody put it all the way in the back and it was the only one left so it was pre pretty apparent that it was trying to be hidden it literally it was behind the other regular elites all right so we got double jointed knees over here it moves pretty good um, even with the knee pads there we also have over here um, back motion and forward motion ankle and side as well. So from both sides over here. Also you have your calf boot swivel over here basically. And you got your um, thigh swivel as well. So pretty decent poses, double jointed elbows. So head goes up. I mean, you can move it up, but it won't really stay up because of the hair, you know. Um, goes down decently. Um, not really side to side motion, really, because of the hair. But you could turn the head with no problem, but not like a tilt motion, really, because of the hair, you know. A little bit if you want to, you know? So, not bad. All right, so the cool thing about this figure of Scott Hall, of course, you know, the red looks cool and whatever, but, you know, cool thing about it is that he actually won the United States Heavyweight Champion as an NWE Elite member. So, you know, that's pretty cool. But it was short-lived because um, he had an accident where a vehicle backed over his foot. So he was basically put on a shelf, you know? Subsequently, he did got stripped out of his title, so that kind of sucks, but I mean, he did have that going for him. Hogan was the champion again as an elite member. I think Scott Steiner was a television champion, um, and yeah, so they were doing pretty decent, you know, off rip. So it was nice, but yeah, guys, uh, let's see what else. Oh, yeah, and he's super hairy, man. Oh, and of course, how can I forget? App Crunch. That shirt just hit it nicely. But, yeah, and, yeah, they they went in on the hair, you know? They went in on the hair. Um, but, yeah, pretty good-looking figure. And, all right, guys. Hope you guys enjoy. Stay a little longer. That way you guys can see um, some music clips and some cool little action poses with Scott Hall. And leave a comment, guys. Um, if I reach 250 subscribers, um, which I know eventually I would, but if I receive it within the next week or so, um, and you guys leave a comment on this video, then you guys will automatically be um, in a live drawing. So, yeah, if I reach 250 um, subscribers within the week, and you guys leave a comment, whoever left a comment, well the comment has to be a code comment, that way I know that you guys actually um, want to enter. The comment has to be four horsemen. You can put whatever else, you know, if you guys want to say what's up or whatever, that's cool. But you have to put four horsemen, no way in particular, you know, spelling wise, just put four horsemen and um, you'll, you'll enter to win this baby. So fully sealed, Ric Flair. Chris Benoit, and there's a special um, WCW Collector's Edition, Dean Malenko, and Steve Mongo, from Toy Biz, and Authentic, 
and it's a pretty good shape and it is sealed as well both sides here's the back really nice this is very I usually uh, unbox everything but this looks like a really nice display piece you know so I left it in the box but um, uh, I want to keep the channel a hundo you know and I'm just doing six seven inch figures so I'll let you guys enjoy these because this is actually five inch scale I believe so but all right guys leave a comment blazing all right and we got a little comparison here of the NW Elite Scott Hall versus the NWO Scott Hall so yeah both look good in their perspective right um, definitely love the toothpick thing you know definitely his style you know but yeah Thanks so much for watching the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys want more Blazing Toys reviews, click here for my latest video or click here for a playlist of a couple of my videos as well. That way you guys can enjoy it, alright? Blazing! Yeah, check it out, man. It's your boy, Lito. I got free power.